Following this, we call on all structures to focus all their energies on the campaign for total election victory, using the EFF's manifesto as the weapon to win the hearts and minds of our people. The campaign must continue to be based on umtu emtuini mutumutu, as every vote counts in the war for economic freedom. We reiterate the call for Cyril Ramaphosa to announce the election date, as his delay will not save him from his inevitable removal from office. Until then, all South Africans must continue to register to vote on the IEC elections website as the voters' roll remains open until such a time the election date is proclaimed. We take this opportunity to welcome back home and congratulate Wafana Wafana for their courageous performance and the bronze medal in the recent AFCON competition. We believe that we can build on this progress. We call on SAFA to make sure that they pay reasonable remuneration to players and the technical team for the national team and ensure that there is an equal pay for Banyana Banyan. We call upon the racist corporate South Africa to sponsor Bafana Bafana and Banyana Banyana as they are equally important to the development of sports. The EFF reiterates the call by the EFF Student Command that the contracts of all four service providers which were irregularly appointed at NSFAS must be terminated with immediate effect as determined by an independent forensic report. The continued irregularity at NSFAS is something that must be fought tooth and nail if we are to resolve the crisis of funding of students and this can only be done through uprooting corruption. The EFF notes the recent attacks on Palestine, a clear demonstration of defiance by the racist genocidal apartheid Israel and their murderers Benjamin Netanyahu and undermining of the International Court of Justice that ordered Israel to stop. If the bombardment and genocide of Palestinians continues, will be left with no choice but to march to the American embassy as we no longer have the Israeli embassy in South Africa. We will march to the American embassy as a sponsor of the war and genocide in Palestine. We are proud to announce the return of fighter Siko Kelishe as head of digital communication and stakeholder relations in the president's office. We wish her well in her new responsibilities. I thank you.